Halloween is quickly approaching and today I'm going to show you a simple engineering project that you can work on. Um, it's pretty fun as well. And what we're going to be creating is a pumpkin catapult using some basic materials. And I'm gonna go over the, those materials with you now. To create the catapult, you're going to need six rubber bands, one spoon, 10 craft sticks, and one candy corn pumpkin. To get started, the first thing I like to do when creating a craft stick catapult is I like to gather or stack six craft sticks and then secure them with one of the rubber bands on either side. Now, along with the materials you see here, you also want to think about a fun target to practice launching your catapult. All right, so next what I'm going to do is take two craft sticks, stack them together on top, and two craft sticks that I'm going to stack together and place on the bottom, and then gather the ends here with the rubber band. Hold that there and I'm just going to bring this together with the rubber band. Here we go. Makes it a little bit more secure, but we also want to add rubber bands in like an X formation here in the middle to secure our catapult. So to do that, I'm going to bring my rubber band, one of the rubber bands this way, going across this section of the catapult and this section of the catapult. And then I'm going to do the same thing on this side over here. A little tricky. Leave it to a Halloween engineering project to be pretty tricky. You can leave it like that because I don't want anything to break. All right. I need to lower this. There we go. All right. So I have the makings of my catapult here. Looks like it's almost ready to launch, but I want to place my candy corn pumpkin somewhere. So that is where the spoon comes in. We want to attach the spoon to the catapult so that the candy corn pumpkin has a nice secure spot to rest before we launch. So there we go, there's our catapults. We have a spot for our candy corn pumpkin. So let's talk about what we can use as a target to launch our catapult. You can set something like that up See how far you can get that jack-o'-lantern. It didn't score any points. But that's the fun of it. We keep trying until you score some points. So when we're talking about the engineering design process, we're talking about a process in which you ask, imagine and plan, create, test and improve, and communicate. When engineering pumpkin catapults, we can explore through engineering by asking, can you design and build a catapult that will launch a pumpkin successfully towards a target? When testing, see how far you can safely launch your pumpkin. And when improving your catapults, you want to ask yourself, how can I make my catapult better? Can I build a catapult with more than one spoon? I hope that during this Halloween season, you take some time to have fun and create your own pumpkin catapults. Enjoy everyone.